got me into that one club where you know who hangs out at. I saw her writing something on a napkin. Do you think she's planning her new movie? Because maybe I could talk to her, get her to put in a word with the casting director. Charlotte, that is amazing. <laughs> I can't wait to see you. Tomorrow. Tomorrow? I can't believe it, babe! <laughs> Everything's gonna be perfect now. So, birthday boy, just how much money is your dad gonna give you? Uh, well, you talk to him, right? Not, not yet. Go be with your family. It's not even a question. I feel terrible leaving at such a busy time. Maybe I could. Mila, you have led this team for years without ever being so much as late for work. We'll be fine. As your friend, I say go. Don't make me pull the boss card on you, too. Okay, thanks, Jasper. We're all here for you. Going somewhere? Shouldn't you be out on a tractor or something? <laughs> Dad called in everybody early for your birthday. Food should be here any minute. Seriously, what's with the bag? Don't worry about it, Brody. Where's Dad? I need to talk to him. <laughs> hey, here's the birthday boy. This is a big one. How are you feeling? I can't stay. What? Asher, I... It's Ash. I don't understand. Dad, I've told you this before, right? I'm leaving. Moving. Tonight. Charlotte thinks that if- You can't I'm leave now, because it's a busy season. You know that, Asher. And I want my half. I'm 18 now, so however that works, you just send it over. Do you hear yourself? You selfish brat? Mom left that for us. She left that for all of this. This, this place, this house, it died. When mom died. At least for me. So... So that's it then? That's it. Okay. Well, uh... I'll transfer your half of everything into your account. Okay. How long till we uh, see you again? A while, if I can help it. You can keep the cake. gonna abandon us, huh? <laughs> Dad needs us both. Oh, does he? Huh? Does he need us? Does he need me with a son like you? Get out of here, man. Just stop. What? Asher, you're, you're gonna break Dad's heart. Oh, yeah, am I breaking his heart? I'm gonna break his heart? What about my heart, huh? What about my heart? Oh, it's all about you. Back away from my truck, dude. Brody, get away from my truck. contact with the director, so she does. And he's telling me about how he needs a blonde for this new movie. And so I pitch myself, obviously. And you know what he said? 
He said that I got the part. Ash, are you listening? What? Hey, what? I got the part. Oh, uh, yeah, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> no, they said I'm just perfect for it. I knew you were perfect for Aww. it. Aww. Yeah, how about this, after fireworks. Hey, smile. After the fireworks, how about I go get you another piece of jewelry or something, huh? Yeah. A little celebration. Mr. Beery, your card was declined. Uh, de what? Just, no, it's fine, just run it again. You ran it three times, sir. Uh, babe, do you have your, ooh, do you have your card on you? What's wrong with yours? I don't know, it's kind of weird. Their systems are messing up or something. Uh, yeah, let me check. Oh, dang it. I forgot it. I put it in the car. Um, I'll go run and get it real quick and oh, then I'll no. just come back. I'll Can you give me the it. keys? No, I'll go get Actually, it. Actually, no, no, it's okay. Uh, babe, uh, it's okay. Uh, give me the keys. Charlotte, are you sure it's not in your purse? Sure. Mr. Barrett, may I be frank? You've been tolerated here, but you don't belong in a place like this. Promise me you'll eat somewhere else next time, and I will waive this considerable bill. How's that sound? It's fine. Not, not a problem at all, I understand. Yeah. No, I, I, I understand. Well, if, if any other positions open. Okay. Alrighty, well, thank you. Hi, this is Ash Barrett. Uh, I, yes, I applied last week. I was wondering if you guys um, had any other openings. Uh huh. Mm. Okay. Well, uh, bye. I, I'm I'm still working on that. I'll clean it up when I'm done. Hey, Dad. It's uh, me, Ash, Asher. 
It's gone, Dad. Everything. I, uh... I lost it. Nothing's left. Nobody's left. I hated you when Mom died. I felt like you never saw me, understood me the way that she did. You wanted a life for me that I didn't get to choose. I thought maybe if I left that place, I, I would feel seen again, alive. I searched everywhere for that feeling. Coming up empty. I'm tired, Dad. And I'm hungry, and... I miss home. I miss home, Dad. I'm gonna sell this phone and uh, maybe whatever I can get, I can get a bus ticket. I don't know, we'll see how far it gets me. Bye, Dad. Ash, you're home. I'll make it up to you. Hey, I promise I'll make it up to you. I will work every single day. I promise, okay? I'll get a place close by. Close oh, by, I'm Ash! Mad. I promise if you let me do this, I'll make up for it. I, I haven't earned anything and I don't deserve this. Ash, I just, this Ash. Is... You're home. I don't need anything else. That's enough. I love you. No matter what. No matter what. Hey, uh, you know what today is? <laughs> it's, it's your birthday. Really? <laughs> and we're gonna celebrate big time. <laughs> He'll be all right, Dad. He's sharp. And we'll be okay. I've tried my entire life to provide for you both, especially after your mom passed. Asher always had to figure things out on his own, didn't he? dark out there, should I have let him leave? I'm gonna cover for him around here. Oh, just don't, don't worry about that, Brody. Let's, let's eat before this food gets cold.
I'm talking with Mila today. She thinks that we can double our numbers from last year. Hmm. I think that we can if we shift some roles around, hire some temporary workers. Dad, are you hearing any of this? Or? I, I'm sorry. I think that's a great plan. I'm proud of you, son. You think it's Asher? Why are you texting me? Trying to get through. You've been on another planet the last hour. I'm sorry, I'm just worried about him. He is 18, and he left us. Just let him go. He's my son. He's your brother. No, he didn't want us. I don't want him either. You don't mean that. Yes, I do. Going to bed. Early day tomorrow. Morning, son. Morning, Dad. What you doing? Just thinking and praying. Thinking and praying. I can give him a call later today. You know, he probably just needs some time to cool off. Mm. Mm. Oh, that's my reminder. I am late to meet with the corn supplier. His name's Arthur. He's a good guy. Ask him how Betty's doing. His wife? His cat. You better get going. You're gonna be late too, boss. Love you, son. Yeah. Okay, Dad, deal of a lifetime today. Which tide you choose, because we cannot be matching. Anyway, that's, that's about enough for me. Brody and I are about ready to head off to work, and we'll... Brody, you want to leave a message for Ash? Love you, son. We're gonna be late, Dad. You're not even dressed. It won't take me five minutes. Let's sit a second. I made his coffee. It's been a year, Dad, and he hasn't answered a single call or text. Stop holding on to a ghost. He's not dead, Brody. He's just lost. You search for things that are lost till they're not lost anymore. It's all I know to do. Well, while you're searching for your lost son, your other son's trying to keep the business alive. Alive? We're doing fine. Not if we mess this up. This meeting's important. To who? I just wish you'd look for me sometimes. I am with you every day. I see the man you're becoming, and I couldn't be more proud of you, Brody. Hey. I love you, son. Or the red tie. It's slimming.
Mind if I join you? You're my guest. How can you just welcome him back with wide open arms? What was I supposed to do? Make him feel it. Just once. Make him actually earn it for once in his life. Do you think you actually earned anything that was truly meaningful from me? Brody, everything I have, all of this, and, and all of this, I give to you and to Ash because I want to. I can't help it. From the moment I held you in my arms, I was hooked. The love I feel for you and your brother, is, it's impossible to describe. It's, it's without condition or, or qualification. Getting to watch the both of you chase after your dreams, that's just icing on the cake. But I say, Dad, may sacrifices give away all those dreams. And you told me you wanted to be here. Here? I could be anywhere. I was a class president, valedictorian, varsity, full ride in every sport, but I worked and I worked and I worked. And, and I could not be more proud of you for all of those things. But that's not why I love you, Brody. I love you because you're my son. And even though Ash left, I love him every bit as much. In fact, <laughs> I, I can't love either one of you any less than I do. I just can't. That's just not fair. Your, your brother has been lost for a long time. He's, he's home now. I think that's a really good reason to celebrate. And Ash hasn't quit asking about you since he got back. Despite everything else, you're still his big brother. I hope you'll join us. Everything is better when we're all together. <laughs>